Welcome back. In this video, we will learn how to record a test case using a sample e-commerce website as an example. When you first launch Stress Stimulus, a welcome screen will appear. It will direct you to record a test case. If the welcome screen is hidden, click the Record button on the workflow tree to start recording instead. Click the Record Test Case button to start the test wizard. It will walk you through the steps of creating, configuring, and running a test. At the wizard's welcome screen, click Next to go to the Recording Source step. Give your test case a name. The test scenario will include adding a product to the shopping cart in the eStore. Then select a recording source. For browser-based applications, choose a web browser from the list of browsers installed on your machine. The other choices are non-browser applications such as Silverlight or Flex, or a mobile device. You can also open an existing test. Click Next to go to the Browser Settings step and type the URL of the website you are testing. Then click Record to launch the browser and open the eStore homepage. The Recorder window will appear at the top. In Stress Stimulus, you can track the performance of not only individual requests and web pages, but also transactions. A transaction is a group of user actions bundled together for the purpose of tracking and analyzing their performance. First, I am going to log in. I enter Login into the Recorder's transaction box to start the login transaction. Now I can enter user credentials. Then I am going to select a product, so I enter the Add to Cart transaction. After that, I will add a laptop to the cart. The recorder keeps track of the recording time and the number of captured requests. Finally, I will log out. When recording is complete, click the Stop button on the recorder. At this point, the test wizard will process the recorded sessions and move to the Configuring the Test Case step. We will learn about this in the next video. As you can see, the wizard makes Stress Stimulus very easy to use. Thank you for watching.